Okay, I've got a hundred foot cord piled up on the ground here. So when I start out, I'm going to leave a long enough end so that I can wrap up the uh, coil when I get done. Package. So, take it across your hand, stretch out, hold it so that you get as much as for a long cord you want to get a lot. Bring it back and put it back in your hand the same direction it came from to make a loop on this side. Now stretch out again, make a similar loop. This time you come around to the other side. So now we've got a loop on each side, like that. We keep doing that. We'll just take this loop, put it back so it stays on that side. Take the next loop, sort of turn a little bit so it'll go down on that side. Again, a pair of loops on each side. And we'll just keep doing that. And because there are no twists induced in this, or you know, needing to coil it, as long as the pile on the ground isn't too messy, you can just keep pulling it off that pile and putting it on here. Whereas when you coil line rope, you have to just uh, keep stretching it out so the loops take themselves out. But here we're getting along there. Keep doing it till we're done. As we get to the end, we still have a bunch of loops on one side, a bunch of loops on the other side, and we have it in the middle. Now to store it up, we need to wrap this up, so we'll just take the long end that we left, and now you see why we left it long, because it goes around quite a ways, and we need to take a number of turns, and we'll just tightly coil this up. Like that. Other people tie it the other way, but you can uh, do this the same way as you do other coiling, and you end up with a package that you can hang up or lay down in your truck or whatever. I like to leave this end out a little bit if I can, just so that it doesn't get, go through and actually make a knot later. Now, when you're ready to use this, you do the reverse and coil it here. But now, we can open this up and we, you can see that we have the two things. And if we lay it out kind of flat, we have the zigzag cord. We grab the end and start pulling it out. You find that it just kind of pulls off there without tangling and knotting, and we can just drag our cord out as we need it.